Good morning and welcome to Eagles Nest Live for your AHS Morning News. Hello, I'm Sydney. And I'm Aaron, and we are here to provide you with the news for today, Friday, March 4th. School art competition starts today. Up to three entries will be accepted until March 25th in room 108. Entries may include drawings, paintings, sculptures, photographs, and digital media. This will be a judge competition. This means only two entries will be displayed and only one entry will receive the title of Best in Show. Entry forms are available by the door in room 109. Please see Ms. Sparks in room 108 for any questions or concerns. Apollo tennis team will have practice after school today at 3.45 p.m. Attention anyone who is interested in joining the wrestling team. Lifting, conditioning, and open mat begins March 14th. Hope to see you then. Today we are on alternative bell schedule. Please check your agenda for today's complete bell schedule. Eagle refuel will be available between first and second periods. So on February 20th, we had a LAN party for the uh, robotics team uh, as a fundraiser. And uh, we were expecting a big turnout, but I think we kind of messed up a little on the date. Uh, we're going to try to do this again, uh, where we can try to get more people involved on like a Friday after school and go late into the night. But for the people who did come, uh, there was a lot of fun uh, going on. We, we, we had a lot of four on four. Uh, Call of Duty Black Ops 3 going on with uh, COD casting and the whole works. Uh, it was really cool. We had a lot of people doing that. Uh, we also had some Smash Brothers tournaments going on. We had some Guitar Hero tournaments. We even broke out the old Atari 2600 so Mr. May could show everybody how good he is at combat. But uh, we'll do this again and we hope to have more people show up. kicked butt at the tournament. We had a pretty good strategy. We just really played and we went undefeated. Nobody can really beat us. And make sure you come out to the next one. We're waiting. We're going to smack everybody. All right, good morning students. Happy Friday. Yay, yay, yay. Getting closer to springtime. I've got little uh, daffodils coming up in my yard. I'm excited about it. Let's move on out of this winter weather. Couple of things. Juniors, your new homeroom assignments are now in your IC. Um, so please look where you check your grades, check your schedule. Your new homeroom teacher that starts Monday is in your IC. Please check there. It's the homeroom teacher that you had when school started. Okay, so FYI, if there's anything uh, you have, question you have about that, please stop in guidance and see me today. Another thing, and they may mention already on the announcements, that uh, today's the deadline to register for the April 9th ACT test. Freshman and sophomore, there's a whole lot of opportunities going on for you all for next school year. Uh, I hope you've talked to your folks about taking an ACT if you need a score for any of the academies coming up, any of the early college opportunities. Uh, please be mindful the deadline is today at midnight, online, only with a debit or credit card for payment, $39.50. The other thing I want to make mention is uh, scheduling. If you've missed school any this week, uh, we had scheduling assemblies um, on Tuesday, so it's important that you stop in guidance if you do not have your paperwork to schedule for your next school year. I've encouraged juniors to make sure you email me and I'll get appointments with you to meet with me for questions you may have. Um, I had 10 juniors yesterday email me and I met with them individually or group. Please juniors continue to email me. I'll send you a calendar invite. Please respond and let's get together and meet on those opportunities that are coming your way for senior year. I'm pretty excited about it for you. Um, again, juniors, check IC for your new homeroom listing. Thank you. Have a great day. 
If you would like to be a peer tutor for the 2016-2017 year, uh, applications are available in the guidance office. In addition to your application, your grades, attendance, and behavior are also taken into consideration. Stop in guidance to pick up your peer tutor application for next school year as soon as possible. Attention students, the class list for, for the 2016-2017 school year has been posted to Ms. Berry's door. If you have auditioned for Applications for the 2016-2017 yearbook staff are now available outside of Mr. Poff's room, room 304. All applications must be returned by Monday, March 7th. No late applications will be accepted. If you have questions, please see Mr. Poff in room 304. The Public Library is hosting a coffee house for teens on Friday, March 11th from 6 to 7.30 p.m. The program is geared towards teens in 6th through 12th grade who are interested in creative writing and want to connect with other like-minded teens. You will have the opportunity to do free writing, enjoy fresh refreshments, and share your work in a relaxed, non-judgmental environment. Stop by the library for more information. It is that time of year again, time for Apollo's Got Talent. Auditions for this year's talent show will be Monday, March 21st. Please sign up for an audition time on Miss Barry's door. You must sign up for an audition time before March 21st. The prize for the winner of the talent show is $50. On today's lunch menu in the Mama's Kitchen line, we will be having brunch, brunch for lunch, fruit choice, and cookie. In the Global Fair line, hot dog or pizza, french fries, veggies and dip, Caesar salad, fruit choice, and cookie. In the sandwich line, a choice of tuna salad, cheeseburger, chicken, peanut butter and jelly, barbecue rib sandwich, tater tots, veggies and dip, and cookie. In the sub and salad line, sub sandwich or chef salad, fruit choice, veggies and dip, and cookie. We'd like to wish all students good luck in their co-curricular activities. Have a great day. Good morning, faculty, staff, and students. Uh, hope your day has started off well so far, and happy Friday to you. Uh, appreciate the students that were out last night supporting their boys' teams. Un unfortunately, they, we know they did not win, gave a great effort, just uh, couldn't hang in there, and uh, will not be advancing, but thank you to the seniors uh, for all that you did, and then for those that are not seniors, uh, hopefully that'll make you want to work a little harder to uh, go a little further in the tournament next year. But again, thanks for our students. From my perspective, where I was sitting, it seemed like our students did a great job of supporting and encouraging and, and nothing beyond that. So appreciate that. And uh, um, hopefully uh, those same students will now start going out for our spring sports and supporting those young men and young women as they compete in uh, those various sports that'll get kicked off here pretty, pretty soon. Okay. Uh, Next week, we'll be back on regular schedule. Of course, this week with the ACT, uh, Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday. Of course, that means today we're on our, our alternative schedule, no MP time, but we will restart that next week with regular schedule, so just be looking ahead, except for next Thursday. And I can't remember if I've said this to you or not, but next Thursday, we will be on afternoon activity schedule. We're actually having a, an assembly come in uh, it's called Bring Your A, a Game, and it's a BMX show. Um, I don't know if, I can't remember if you, any of you would have been here. We had this here several years ago. It might have been our current seniors as freshmen. Pretty neat show. It'll last about 40 minutes or so. They'll get here. Uh, we will release you from fifth period by grade level on Thursday. You'll go down to the gym. Hope to get here. We'll probably leave a little earlier than, than typical on that day to get you all in the in the uh, gym and ready to go by about 2.15, 2.20. They'll put on the show and then around three o'clock you'll go back to, to fifth period and finish the day out. But um, what I remember of it, of course my memory seems to get worse every day, but what I remember of it, it was, uh, it was really neat, really neat show and hopefully you will enjoy it and it's got a good message behind it. Uh, you know, about doing your best, that type of thing. So anyway, that's going on next Thursday, but all other days, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Friday, we'll be on our regular schedule. Okay, birthdays today for Friday the 4th, Anna Rutland and Sarah Tran. For Saturday, tomorrow, Alec, Alec Clark, Sean McElwain, and Trevor Nave. And then on Sunday, Danielle Dixon, Sydney Otsby, Blake Roby, Tia Tucker, and Michael Wall. So we wish those students a happy birthday. Didn't look, look like we have any staff birthdays. Let's have a great day. Uh, remember, be kind, be patient to one another, always respectful. Uh, make good decisions today through the weekend, and we'll see you back here on Monday. Thank you. Please stand for the pledge. Attention, salute, pledge. 
I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all.